yeah hello and welcome to the channel the name is guru boy today we do have the samsung galaxy a10x right over here which has been on the google account lock so if you did see this prompt which means you do have google account being locked on your samsung galaxy a10x so first all you have to do is to connect to a wi-fi network and to demonstrate or to show you this device really has google account pin lock on it so when you do connect to a wi-fi network you'll be prompt to sign in into your google account right over here so you won't be able to proceed so first let's turn off our device then switch to our computer because this method will be using the computer to unlock this device so right over here on our desktop screen we will need this file which has been in the description of this video so make sure to download it and it will be in two formats to download one will be in advertisement form so if you want to support this channel make sure to download it from the advertisement link also you have to disable your windows defender so you are in the search bar or search box search for windows security which is already even popping up but you have to type it and make sure you do see windows security right over there so when you do see windows security make sure to open it so if you do open it in it sub menu make sure to go in for virus and threat protection click on it so when it options have been shown click make sure to click on manage settings then the turn off red term protection has been shown here so my red term protection is being turned off now close from the windows now on our desktop we do have the file which we are going to use to format our device so first extract the file using ring wrap or seven zip to extract this file so i'll be extracting it onto my desktop as i said this our uh, file will be in the description of this video so it will be in two formats one in advertisement to support the channel so here we do have the file on the desktop folder on the desktop open the folder and in the folder we do have many folders inside the folder so make sure to go in for sp flash 2 so when you click on sp flash 2 scroll to you see flash 2 then run it so when you run it the sp flash 2 will open then we have to do this so under download agent make sure to choose this file so when you click on choose move to the desktop or where you do extract the file or the zip file too so in the extracted folder move to a10x then select mtk or in one da file so now let's load scatter file also so you choose on scatter file then move to the extracted zip folder then a10x scatter now load the scatter file and wait for it to load it so that's it so the next step we are going to do is to click on format in the sp flash tool then manual format flash so you have other options right over here so all you have to do is to go into the extract or extracted zip folder then you move to the 18x code format now open it and you will see some text in your test edit or the notes so copy the first line then head into the sp flash tool then beginning address paste what you copy into the beginning address then copy the second one to the format length so now let's paste this into the format length and then all you have to do is to head or, or close the notes and head over to the strategy file and then 
in the zip file move to mtk secure boot so when you open this uh, mtk secure boot land the mtk secure bypass so click on it to launch it you can even run it as an administrator so here we do have the mtk secure boot running so all we have to do is to click on crash pl so before we connect our device you have to press the volume up and then the volume down key so you press the volume down up key then you connect your usb cable so when the machine detect your phone release the keys then wait for it to patch and now the preloader is being disabled so now let's open the sp flash tool then on s3 flash to we click on start to begin the format so click start and this is very very quick and that's it it said format okay so from here you are good and all you have to do is to unplug your device from the computer so let's unplug the device from the computer so you can power on your device using the power key only or if the power key is not working you can press the volume down and the power key to power on your phone so let's wait for the phone to boot up so now the phone has finished booting up so all we are going to do here is to set up our device and now even we do have accessibility added to the welcome screen so when you click next you will now have a skip button under the wi-fi so here you click on skip wait for the skip to load now we are in and there is they are not requesting any google account so that is it how to unlock your device so if you are able to make it to this point make sure to go subscribe or even give a like to this video and also the links as i said it will be in the description and also make sure to download from the advertisement link to support the channel and if you do wish not to download from the advertisement link you can use the second option or the second link to download it so let me do a very quick setup on this device So you have to do this last step which you have to factory set your device in settings to be able to install apk files or install application from unknown source if i say unknown source meaning download the apps without downloading it from play store if you do not do this step you will not be able to install any apk files so you have to do it so you'll be able to install package or install any application so if you try to install the application you will get an error saying package installer closed so make sure to factory reset it from settings thanks for watching make sure to subscribe give a like to the video thanks for watching peace